Hey there, everybody. Good morning. It is time for another installment of Seven Minutes in the Morning. This morning and maybe this week, we're going to talk about choosing to win. Stay tuned. This is Seven Minutes in the Morning, where five days a week, you get tips and hacks dedicated to helping business owners and leaders just like you find and break through the one thing that is preventing your success. And now, here's the host of 7 Minutes in the Morning and your results coach, Tom Rigsby. Hey there, everybody. Good morning and welcome. My name is indeed Tom Rigsby, and uh, you have indeed found 7 Minutes in the Morning, the five-day-a-week video podcast where we talk about how to start, grow, and enjoy the benefits of business ownership when you get here. Whether you're watching live or on the replay, either way, it works just the same. Leave a comment, say hi like Joe has done, say good morning to all of America, and in fact, all the world, if you so desire. Today, I want to kick the week off by talking about making a choice. Making a choice. You know, um, man, there are so many great ways to go with this. We have the opportunity every day to choose how the day is going to turn out. Now, you you might disagree with that. You might, well, in fact, lots of people disagree with that. No, 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 no. You don't understand, Tom. My day is completely ruled by other idiots. I mean, other people. Well, okay. But you still have a choice. You can... For example, be frustrated with them, even though you knew that's what was going to happen. You can choose to be frustrated by them, or you can be entertained by them. Right? It's a choice. And so the the the, the thing I want you to think about today, right? Our title today is Choosing to Win. And... You know, it's Monday. I specifically chose this topic for today because a lot of people hit Mondays and like, oh, it's Monday. I don't like Mondays. Well, if you tell yourself you don't like Monday, of course you're not going to like Monday. You got to love Mondays. Mondays are when the magic happens, right? But it's a choice. You just have to choose. How do you, I mean, how do you want to feel today? Do you want to feel like crap today? Do you want to feel like a winner today? Choose to win. That's the topic. Man, I might not even go three minutes today. I've really pounded that home already. I'll just get a sip of coffee and see if we can drag it out here for another minute. So um, over on Instagram today, I'm going to be talking about uh, this very thing, how you can make a choice. <clears throat> now, what happens when you feel like you're out of control? And this, look, this is really why choice is important. Because choice, how you choose to respond to a set of circumstances is in your control. And if you feel like your life, your business, your work is out of control, it's because you don't have any choices. Now, My good friend and mentor, Tony Robbins, says you have to have three options to have a real choice. If you don't have any options, or if you only have one option, then you have no choice. If you only have two, then you have a dilemma. You have to have three. I could probably go with two or three in most circumstances, but there's always a choice. Now, one of the things, we'll get into this a lot more later in the week, but one of the things that a lot of people complain about is, well, I, you know, well, but you don't understand, I don't really have a choice. You, what you really say saying is you don't have an option, but that's because you've used up all of your options and poor previous choices. We are, I mean, choices have a cumulative effect. And if you make a bad choice, yeah, what was the example I used? If you choose to cut off your leg, you can't later on choose to run in a marathon. Well, I guess you can, but it's going to be a lot harder. You'd be hopping a marathon. But the point is, they have a cumulative effect. You know, a bad choice or a good choice previously is going to yield 
a bad choice or a good choice later on or the opportunity for one. Joe says to choose to respond instead of react. I like that. I like that. Respond is something that you intentionally do. React is just a reflex. Don't, don't do that. Don't react. All right. That's it. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up for today. Look at that five minute show today. You like that? I like that. The point, I mean, this is a really simple topic. You just choose to have a good day today. No matter what happens, look for the entertainment value or the positive value out of it and then choose to focus on that. Where focus goes, energy flows. If I focus on, yeah, absolutely, Joe, good choices have a magnifying effect. If I choose, if I've got 99 people telling me I did a great job and I've got one person telling me that my hair looks funny and I suck and I focus on that one, I'm going to think that things are terrible. But if I focus on the other 99, even if it's opposite, right? If I have one person saying I do great, 99 saying you suck. If you focus on the one, that's where your, that's where your energy is going to go. Eh, forget those people. I don't know what they're talking about. Right? Choose. Choose to have a good day today. And then choose to be back here again tomorrow for another installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning to happen every morning, every weekday morning, 7 a.m. with me, Tom Rigsby, your host. Hope that you will choose to join me tomorrow. You guys have a magnificent Monday. I will talk to you today or today, tomorrow. Take care.